In this video, I'm going to show you how to schedule your Mac to sleep or shut down in OS Ventura. Hi and welcome or welcome back to DIY Film with Merle Becker, the channel where I help you make better videos. As always, stick around to the end of the video for a bonus tip. All right, so I recently upgraded to OS Ventura, which is fine, except for one big thing which is missing. And that is the ability to schedule my Mac to shut down by itself after I do a big export. Previously, I would set up my export schedule shutdown in Energy Saver schedule and then go to bed. And I could export overnight and not burn down my laptop battery. But Apple did away with this feature in OS Ventura. So much for being energy conscious, Apple, am I right? Anyhow, I'm going to show you how to do a scheduled shutdown using Terminal. By the way, this is the way Apple expects you to do a scheduled shutdown in Ventura, as per their help page. In any case, here you go. I'm working in Ventura 13.3.1, so if yours is older or newer, it might look slightly different. So for this video, I'm first going to show you how to do a shutdown that repeats, then I'll show you how to do a single event shutdown. All right, make sure you're logged into your computer. Also, your Mac must be awake and you must be logged in for it to shut down at the scheduled time. Then open up the Terminal app by going to Applications, Utilities, and finding the Terminal app. Double click it. Terminal, for those of you who have never used it, is sort of a behind the scenes way to create commands for your OS without using other apps. You just type the code right into Terminal. It's typically used by network administrators or advanced technical users, and I usually don't mess with it much, but here we are. For this example, I'm going to type code in Terminal that will tell my Mac to schedule a shutdown every day of the week at 1 a.m., and I'll show you how to modify this code according to your needs. First, I want you to type this exactly, sudo pm set. Sudo means you want to run this command with administrator privileges, and PMSET stands for Power Manager Set, which manages your computer's power. Then, if you want this action to repeat, you would type repeat. Then, type shutdown, which will tell your computer to shut down. Some other commands you could use here are restart or sleep. Then, specify the day and time you want it to shut down. First, we'll do the day. As mentioned, I want my computer to shut down every day for this example, so I'm going to type the letter for every day of the week. Only type the first letter of the day. There are some repeating letters, so if you want a Thursday, type R, or a Sunday, type U. And after that, type in the time you want it to shut down. Code for time in Terminal is military time, and it's formatted like so. 1 a.m. is written like this. If you wanted one in the afternoon, you would add 12 hours and write it like so. All right, that's it. Now hit return and it'll ask you for your password. Without clicking again in terminal, just type your password. Hit return and then you'll see your computer name again, like so. And that means you're good to go. I know it looks like nothing happened, but there is a way to check to make sure your schedule is set up. To make sure it's scheduled properly, type in pmset-g. Sched. Sched is schedule abbreviated. Hit enter and you should see exactly what you have scheduled. Mine says repeating power events shut down at 1 a.m. every day, which is what I want. And lastly, if you want to cancel your scheduled shutdown, type in sudo pmset repeat cancel. Now let's show you how to do a single shutdown event. For a one-time shutdown, you would also write sudo pmset schedule, but this time write out the word schedule. Then type shutdown. Then you want to write the date and time you need it to shut down, and you need to put them in quotes, like so. Now if you want to check to make sure it's scheduled properly, type in pmset-g sched, and you see that it has. 
Now, say you want to make another event like so, pseudo PM set schedule, writing out schedule, and putting the date and time in quotes. And say you want to cancel one or both, you would do it like so, pseudo PM set schedule cancel. Then you want to put the number of the event. In this case, it would be zero. All right, you did it. Now you can set up that big export, tell the laptop to shut down at midnight, and you can sleep like a baby knowing your battery won't be drained in the morning. All right, let's do that tip. Now that you've done your first thing in Mac Terminal, I'm gonna show you another slightly less useful trick to give you a little more practice working in Terminal. This one is fun if you have kids. In Terminal, you can make your computer say anything immediately, and this is how. Type the word say, and then type what you want your computer to say, in quotes like so. It's your bedtime, put your pajamas on. Fool your kids, fool your grandparents. Yes, the possibilities are endless. And clean up your room. All right, as always, if you found any of this helpful, please give the video a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the bell so you know when the next one is posted, and I will catch you next time.